the whole gays in the military thing, which doesn't make sense to me because uh, I served time in the Marine Corps, and I remember I was 17 when I first went in, I thought, this is pretty gay. <laughs> Go take a bunch of showers. I'm like, all right, let me see. There's 90 of us, right? There's like 10 shower heads. <laughs> Come on, one minute, 59, 58, 50. How does this, how does this work? I mean, <laughs> the only way to do this, if we all strip down naked and rub around and bump our dicks against each other and all that, surely you wouldn't want that to happen. <laughs> I know you'd want to keep our dicks from touching each other, right? No. They want it. Anytime in the military the dicks get close, they try to make them touch. I, I was, six urinals in the building, right? Here, places to pee, right? 80 dudes, hurry up! Everyone go piss right now, right now, right? Good. What do we got to do? Three, four guys around each urinal. Excuse me, God, man. Hey, man. You should check out that mole. It's, I'm not looking. I'm saying I'm fucked. It's just, there's three, four dicks in every urinal. Am I lying? Has anyone been like, no, true? am I shitting you? And then they go, line up, scoot up, get closer. You're like, all right, I'm close. I mean, dude's right here. I mean, I'm close, right? No, get closer. They'll come behind the last guy, push him in the ass to shove his dick into the ass of the guy. And you know what they call it? Asshole the belly button. Asshole the belly button. Line up, asshole the belly button, right? The towels barely wrapped, you have to hold them. It's no place for a straight man, I'm telling you. He's in the military. I couldn't believe it. The uniform? It's like your collar and you just you got threads on your shoulders. It's not good. I mean look at your cuffs. They're supposed to go over your bicep. And your shave is not that good, but you know, you don't really need to shave. Your skin is already so smooth. So far, far from home. <laughs> it looks so good. I could I didn't understand it. I joined the Marine Corps, right? I'm like, who cares what my cuffs are, motherfucker? I'm a killer, right? I'm like, what what is this? It didn't make any sense, right? It was like I was in there for a year until I was like, hey, did uh did I miss something, sir? Uh we're supposed to play giant chess in a lightning storm on horseback on the commercial. Yeah. And you know, where's I haven't seen it. There's a huge thing and we go like that. <laughs> Out, never. I've cleaned like 900 trucks, and yet, you know, you know, I'm waiting. My mom's waiting for pictures. And she, I'm like, I'm telling her, I don't know, mom, the chessboard is somewhere. I just, I know it's somewhere. I don't know. I don't know if the lightning's real. I don't know if they have a machine. I, you know, I'm, I'm waiting until we get that part. So far, they're just making us rub our dicks together. Uh, uh, <laughs> no. No stalls, no walls or doors in the stalls, ladies and gentlemen, right? Why make us live that way? You know, this, you know, to me, wiping your ass, it's such, it's such a private time. It's such an alone, it's such a me moment, you know, not really. And then you have to discover, because you're in the military with guys from all over the country, right, that some guys actually wipe their ass back to front. Who? I blame the mothers. What mother would let your boy smear across the bottom of his nuts and then he's done? Will you let what? He's just, it's just a racing stripe, put on your pants. Oh no. I could never ask, I didn't know where these guys were from, Kentucky or something, I could never ask them. The front wipers. It's like, that's what I bring out of the military. What'd you get out of the military, son? Honor, duty, patriotism, service? I go, um, some guys put shit on their nets. Mostly, it's in here. I just can't crack that part out of my experience. So, uh,